It's exactly one month since the dastardly killing of Arunachal Pradesh NPP MLA Thirongabo and 10 others by unidentified miscreants in the state's Khonsa district. But where does the investigation into this sensational case stand at the moment? Well, even though the Arunachal government has handed over the case to the National Investigation Agency, not a single arrest has been made into the incident so far. It is to be noted that an NIA team is camping in Khonsa currently to carry out the investigations. Speaking to Northeast Live, Arunachal Pradesh Chief Minister Pema Khandu informed the center is closely monitoring the investigation process. Khandu also met Home Ministry officials recently requesting that the case be treated with urgency. I've been already forward uh, to the NIA and this time I had a meeting in the Home Ministry also where I have met the Home Secretary and I have already insisted him to make a progress, uh, result achieving progress uh, because public are also wanting some kind of uh, good results in this regard. So Government of India is uh, very much serious and MHA is uh, totally monitoring this matter. However, NPP's Thirab District President Noklam Besai has expressed concerns over the investigation process stating that the probe has barely yielded any results so far. He alleged that there is a lack of coordination among the various security agencies on ground. As of now, no breakthrough in the case has been registered. No one, not a single person has yet been arrested. And we are unaware of what is going on, even the investigation is uh, properly going on or not. We have not. So it is uh, really a thing of concern for all of us. Uh, now we are thinking of uh, once again appealing to the government that what's going on, what is the update. NPP's rowing MLA Muchumiti, meanwhile, said the party is waiting for the police investigation to end. We also uh, are not aware of the exact status of it, but what we know is that the people are there in the ground, the NIA is there in the ground, the local police is assisting them, so we are still uh, fine with till now what the approach has been taken. But we hope that from time to time uh, the NIA also will uh, communicate to us and the state government also that It was on May 21st that unidentified miscreants attacked the four-vehicle convoy of Tirangabo, opening indiscriminate fire, killing him and 10 others including his 19-year-old son. The sensational incident took place when Abo was returning to Khonsa from a Sam's Debrugger. The broad daylight murder had shook the state. With inputs from Ripunjar Das and Zahir Akram, we do report Northeast Life.